Well, heading up to the old New Hampshire farm. I was here last year, and I remember the old road washed out. Yeah, I rolled my ankle. Not terribly bad, but I remember. So, yeah, it's been a year. And as usual, when I make my revisits, I'm going to try to hit some different ground. I got to go up the hill here, still a ways. Get up to where the deserted farm is on the hill, and then we're going to go check some of the back squares, which I haven't been in nine or ten years, really. I have not, you know, well, and all the trips in recent years haven't gone back out there but I start my videos early like this because it's it's almost a mile of a walk you know gotta start at some point this way we can absorb some of the scenery along the way well at least the uh, ferns and stuff are dying off out there so we'll see what it looks like in the square when I get up there. At least it's downhill on the way back. Whew. So here it is, the old square out behind where the house was. It's been gone since the late 1800s. And let's see if there's anything in the ground. Well, I'm assuming there's gonna be a lot of ammo related targets in the ground. We shall dig them all. 22 slug. Huh. It's a aluminum can. It's about six inches down. More like a you know, fruit tin can or something. <sighs> Another slug. Not a bad thing though, because everyone digs over there. So the fact that I've just walked in and there's signals, still, that's good. idea two pieces of flat iron stuff deep and lead so here's something small but interesting you can see the field edge here the lines I tell you guys about they're working the top part and the walls just down there a little bit of the ways and I was just walking along it and there's a nice shard. And I'm walking it as always because if they were plowing up here, everything had a tendency to just keep working to the final edge like that. So even all the nails end up down here. It's a thing. It's a little square tube. That's it. It's a thing. Big nail. Wow. That was the nail. Bailing wire. Jeez. This place is loaded with stuff. Mostly nails out here. 
I just haven't been showing you guys everything, but I've been at it for some time. Now that's weird. I'm a hundred feet away from where I just dug the last chunk of it. And there's more. Just a chunk of something. Huh. I mean, really, listen to this if you can hear it over the wind. It's been like this the whole way through, and I'm at the tail end of the field. Definitely a lot more than normal, so our plow line is right up there, and I figured I'd go back between that and the wall. It's just all nails. It's crazy. Another nail. And they are old square nails. Millions of them. Ah, finally, we have a relic. And it's an awesome relic. A mouth harp. Whew. Finally. Uh, yeah, about an hour and a half. Awesome. And what gets me about the iron is, so the cellar hole where the house was is in the next square. So there's a wall in between, so it's not like everything was being plowed out from there dragging in here there's more iron in this square than there is in that one and I was thinking potash but if you dig where there's potash it tends to be a lot more melted lumpy clumpy stuff it hasn't been that way out here it's just straight up nails but that was worth the walk lead lead Sheet metal. Hmm. Well, that's different. And there's leather in there. I have no idea. I thought it was suspender when I first popped it out, but that is not. Or maybe it is, and I've just never seen one before. And as usual, so I'm over the wall inside where the home was immediately find something. It's usually the case, but had to go out there anyways. That is the first signal I have had in a while above the 4853 ammo range. I've been digging it and digging it. I gotta go after this one. It's probably still ammo. No, it's not ammo. I think it's a little pin. Or, see how it's got the two posts? Or it was the little badge that they would press into a pocket knife handle. At least it was not a casing or something. Well, there is stuff on it. Definitely a neat piece. I appreciate you joining me.
Kind of tough today, but I had to go out there. It just was strange. All nails on that side. All ammo on this side. But the nails, peculiar. All right, everybody. See you soon.